Well, there are a lot of reasons why I moved into a small house. Um, environmental reasons come to mind. Uh, the average American house now puts out like 18 tons worth of greenhouse gases per year. And uh, it puts a lot of construction waste into the landfill as well. And then there's the consumption part, you know, the, the rainforests and all. But uh, more than that, really, I was just tired of doing a lot of housework and maintaining a, more space than I really needed. So um, I figured out that maybe moving into a very small house was for me. Well, after I built my first house, I got some feedback from friends who, uh, who were really excited about my place. They said that they would love to have a small place like mine, and that gave me the impression that maybe I should continue doing it for other folks. So I've been doing it for the last 10 years, ever since. From the news I've seen around, there is quite a trend towards smaller houses, and I'm happy to see uh, American houses starting to taper off a bit in size now. This is a, a major transition for us. Uh, I got married a few months ago and we're having a baby now and we're moving to a piece of land, a pretty small piece of land, just a city lot about four miles north of here and there is a uh, there's a little 500 square foot house there and my house sitting next to that house will equal 600 square feet and between those two spaces um, the three of us shall live and it should be nice. I think 200 square feet per person. I hope it still qualifies me as a small house person. And I guess in the United States where the average house is like 2,300 square feet, uh, it's pretty small still.